What's good, everybody? It's Rick Rogers. I'm in the studio right now, Upper Class Studios right now. I'm working on Rent Dude Part 2. Rent Dude 1 is a classic, will be a classic. As of this date, it hasn't dropped yet, but this shit is gonna be a classic. This shit is crazy. Um, at this point in my life right now, I'm just trying to find my way. And music is the only thing that keeps me focused, because I really don't have shit else to do with my life. I'm a lame nigga with talent, you know what I'm saying? So, this is what I do all day, every day, record niggas, shoot videos, and on my own time, I do my own music. Um, I don't know, yo. Um, Rent Do One is like I said, it's a classic. I took my time with that shit. Everything about every song has everything to do with the title, unlike a lot of these niggas. Um, and that's just cause, I'm a fan of hip hop, so if I heard a, a mixtape or something, I would want it to sound like that. Not to be cocky, but it's something I can listen to, something I can feel. You know what I'm saying? All my music is completely real. Like, I don't say nothing that I don't do. And if I say anything about a car or some shit, that's something that I'm gonna have. So I'm technically not lying about that shit. And that's just how I feel, but I don't talk about guns. I don't talk about moving crack. I don't talk about robbing niggas, cause I never done none of that shit. Like, never sold weed. I don't even like guns, cause they fucking kill people. I do understand why niggas pack guns and shit, but I don't use guns, you know what I mean? Um, I got features on there, of course I got Cowboy Cake on there. I got Abstract on there. I got Street G4G on there. I got um, my nigga Ricky Ruckus who's doing this thing out in Atlanta, he up there. I got um, Young Pella, of course, is up there. And I got my brother Max Payne up there. And I got my nigga Doom up there. And if you ain't been paying attention, I named all the niggas that I fuck with. Not nothing to say about no outside, no, no, you know what I'm saying? Nothing about no outside niggas or nothing. But when I was, the recording process of that mixtape, that's who I was fucking with. That's who kept it real with me. So I keep it real with them niggas and show love on that jump. Um, all the songs are songs with meanings, with pain in them, cause that's what niggas go through, you know what I'm saying? And that's about it, yo. Um, I don't know if a lot of y'all noticed, but I kind of shift my focus from being a producer to being an artist, cause I feel like I perfected that producer shit on, in a way, you know what I'm saying? But um, I can't really have followers being a producer, like, I can't do nothing at any club and have people come out there just because I make beats. You know what I'm saying? And I'm a rapper first before producer. I start making beats because I can't afford to pay other niggas for beats. So I just started doing that and I got good at it. But like I said, I want I want people to notice what I'm doing. Like listen to my music, understand this shit is real. Everything about it is real, like, and that's the main thing. Like even if it's whack to a nigga, I'd rather be Whack than to be a fake nigga, so with that said, Rent Do Volume 2 on the way, Rent Do Volume 1 dropping August 14th, and other than that, you know, look out for the Duke Lord, so we everywhere with that shit, um, we about to turn that up a whole lot, um, watch out for my nigga Izzy, goddamn from Russia with love, and that's my nigga, so I can tell y'all right now, I don't know what the fuck it mean, but if I saw the shit in the store, I would pick it up. Because it's like, from Russia with love, what the fuck he probably be talking about. But he on a whole other type of swag that niggas ain't ready for. Um, Astra got something to remember by two by the drop. Young Pella just dropped. Goddamn, um, 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 what's that shit called? Um, Dreaming Out Loud. 
S Trill about to drop million dollar dream. Street G4G just dropped Mr. William Bird. Doom about to drop DNA problem forever. Cause it's volume four. One, two, three, volume forever. Um, goddamn, Cowboy Cake about to drop. Rise of the Lichens, um, Max Payne just dropped. So basically what I'm saying is we, we working on niggas and we not doing it to make nobody mad. We just working cause we trying to get the fuck out of here. I see niggas online doing that little subliminal shit. It's no point of doing none of that shit, cause nothing you do, nothing you do, can't do, will do, won't do, none of that matters to me, cause I feel like I'm on another level, like, you know what I'm saying, subtweeting and all that stupid shit, that's some more immature type shit, my nigga, I'm 24, two kids, got my own crib, and I'm trying to run two studios at one time, so I have enough on my plate, than to worry about niggas who think they, I, I don't even want to put too much out there, cause I ain't trying to start no shit. But you heard what I said, your rent due, volume two, is on the way. Watch your shit. And make sure you watch that Lonely World video over and over and over and over and over again. Um, I don't know if niggas think I'm doing that whole suicide shit as a gimmick, but that shit is real. Like, people kill themselves, my nigga, only because they probably feel lonely. That's just one reason that I know of for a nigga to feel lonely or a girl to feel lonely. You know what I'm saying? Not giving out too much information, but I deal with people that, you know, get them feelings sometimes and shit. So, and the song honestly wasn't, I didn't make it for that. That song like two years old, but, you know, listening to it and after we came up with the video, it's like, this song might help some people for them to understand that they not lonely. And on top of that, it, it make me want to help change the world in some kind of way, like, Killing yourself, to me, that's just too much. Like, nothing should ever be able to push you to do that. Not judging nobody, but I want to. I want people to understand that. Like, there's other things to do other than that. Because once you're gone, you're gone. Ain't no coming back. So, like I said, man, Rick Rogers, the hit maker. Hope that some money fall on my lap so I can push that shit like it's supposed to be put. If you got money and you trying to invest in somebody who gonna get you your money back, make sure you holler at me. <sighs> Boy, niggas just don't know. I consider my situation limited, man. Look, I do mad shit with nothing. So when I get money and I get something, it's going like, be times like a million. Like, so it's not trying. If you want to work with me, man, work with me now. Because when I get on, like, I ain't no shitty nigga, but I, I'm not coming back. Fuck how everybody else feel. I've been living in this shit 
all my life, nigga, I want to live somewhere else nice, my nigga. Don't judge me, man. Fuck all that hood shit. Not no hood niggas, but I can't do that hood shit, man. That shit don't do nothing for me. And it damn sure don't create a better life for my kids, my nigga. So, like I said, man, if you an investor, whatever, you got anything, holler at me, man. I need the money so I can push my shit right. So I can get on to selling millions and millions of records, my nigga. I'm going to sell millions and millions of records. What's today's date? Today's date is August 8, 2012. VH1 will be playing the same clip. I promise you, I will sell a million records before I die. On like six of my albums, though. And that's just how confident I am. I'm talented, man. Like, it's no, you can't stop talent, man. Like, you can't stop that shit. It's unlimited talent, though. Like, we make hits every single song. Like, every song. That shit is unheard of. Niggas don't do that. So I know my time coming. My time is coming. My time is now. Rent due out August 14th. Um, rent due too. I might just fuck around and drop that shit in like October, some crazy shit. Just pick up the speed on y'all niggas. I got over 300 songs, yo, that y'all ain't even heard. That's my dream car. You already know, man. Shout out to Izzy, man. Who is it? Who the fuck is he? I know who he is. You know who he is? I know who he is. Shout out to Craig. Shout out Abstract. Shout out Cowboy Cake. Shout out my girl. Shout out my kids. Shout out my mom. Shout out my sister. Shout out my cousins. Shout out the employees at Taco Bell. Shout out DJ Hustle Man. Shout out everybody. Everybody motivates me to do this great shit. Shout out everybody. Everybody, man. I don't forget about nobody. Unless I don't like you. So, you already know how that be, man. Shout out everybody, man. We sum it all up. And shout out Clint Eastwood. Shout out Max Payne. Goddamn, shout out Young Reaper. Shout out Young Rob. Everybody. Shout out everybody. Tom Gotti. Hellraiser Care. Free Youth. Everybody, man. Young Pella. Shout out everybody. Everybody that fuck with me, man. Streaks. Doom. One of the realest niggas I know. Doom is a real nigga. Real nigga. And that nigga... He fucks with me, so that, that says something about me. Cowboy Cake is a real nigga, he fuck with me. Streets fuck with me, all these niggas is real niggas, man. Home team or no team, bitch, how about that? Who you ballin' with? Holler at me, man, Rick Rogers, I'm out there.